What's up guys? It's Edward from Canto Mando here. And as you can see, <gasps> I got my shoes on. I gotta get that can of Pringles over there. What should I do? Cares, don't tell. <laughs> but, you know, if this was my house, I don't think I'd be able to do that because, you know, Asians equals no shoes in the house. So, what are some ways you can get your stuff when you've already put your shoes on? Call for help, man. Now, I'm sure this is the way we all love to use. So what happens to me usually is that I'm chilling at home in my bed, watching Netflix, I've got my chips, popcorn, and all of a sudden I hear, Edward, can you do me a favor, please? Bruh. But on the other hand, when I forget my stuff, crickets chirping, no response. <sighs> hey, mom, can you get my backpack for me, please? Wait, my mom, get out the way Mom. Help me. Me! You are so lazy, I'd rather give birth to a piece of barbecue pork than you. Next up, we got the first of the animal poses, the snail. It's also your best bet if you want to act like those people in the horror movies, water down your mouth, hair in your face and everything, and they're crawling towards the camera like... <laughs> That's probably how you look like to your bag or whatever you forgot is you're crawling towards it anyway, right? Number three, we got the tacticians. Now, tacticians are generally people who know how to use their surroundings to their benefit. You see what happens is I've got all this stuff around the shoe area. Brooms and umbrellas. But sometimes if you stretch really, really hard, like you're Harry Potter trying to catch the snitch to win the Quidditch final. And sometimes you can snag what you want without leaving the shoe area. Position number four. I do this one a lot because I always put on one shoe and then I remember, oh, oh I forgot something. Instead of taking out that one shoe, what I'll do is that I'll, I'll hop. I'll hop like a kangaroo. I remember doing those different jumps that track and field meets at elementary school. Triple jump and running long jump and standing long jump and stuff like that. And you're wondering, why the heck am I doing this? I'm not a flamingo. Well, here's the secret. They're actually preparing you for this. Next up, we got the newbie. The newbie is the guy who bends down, undoes their shoes, walks over to the things, gets the stuff, walks back, and puts their shoes back on. What is he not? This person is either a massive rookie or they're just the ideal Asian household kid. One eternity later. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Let us know which type you are because we're actually really curious to know which type is most common out there. And if you forgot something, make sure to let us know in the comment section as well. Like, subscribe, comment, remind Mike to call his girlfriend at 8.15 p.m. every night because he's been missing it recently. And we gotta get him back on the right track. And as always, it's my jam!